Welcome to the April 2024 Salesforce Monthly Roundup brought to you by SaaS Guru. In this Roundup edition, we bring you some of the most exciting and groundbreaking AI announcements, partnerships, and more that Salesforce made in April. So sit back, relax, and get ready for an insider's look into the latest developments in the world of Salesforce. Salesforce announced the beta availability of Einstein Copilot for Tableau on April 2nd. With features including recommended questions, guided calculation creation, and conversational data exploration, this new capability is designed to help users across roles and functions easily access and explore data with AI assistance. A report from Salesforce Futures says the evolution of personal AI assistants or agents will forever change customer company relationships. The report indicates that these digital assistants are becoming increasingly important for solving various problems and will be influenced by consumer preferences and technical experiments, with market dynamics and consumer trade-offs playing a significant role. On April 4th, Salesforce announced new AI-powered features for MuleSoft designed to pull more data, improve productivity, and simplify workflows. With the new Intelligent Document Processing IDP and Einstein AI-enabled capabilities, users can rapidly extract and organize data from documents like images and PDFs. They can format responses, classify documents, and trigger actions using written prompts alone, thus eliminating the need for AI model training. The company reported that the IDP functionality will be available in the third quarter of 2024. Meanwhile, AnyPoint Code Builder, MuleSoft Accelerators for Industries, and a new observability with AnyPoint monitoring solutions are generally available to all customers. In a landmark move, Salesforce announced an expanded partnership with Ikevia to co-develop a life sciences cloud on April 8. The new collaboration aims to apply innovations from Ikevia, OCE with Salesforce's life sciences cloud to provide customers with a new single, end-to-end -end engagement platform. Salesforce reported that both companies will work jointly to market the latest offering slated to be available in 2025. Doubling down on its commitment to cybersecurity, Salesforce released new bug bounty learning content on its Trailhead platform on April 9th. The new learning content, branded as a playbook, aims to assist customers in developing their bug bounty programs while focusing on staying ahead of threats, including emerging AI-backed ones. The same day, Salesforce announced the general availability of unified conversations for WhatsApp. This innovative solution represents a stride forward in AI-powered customer engagement. The new integration enables brands to connect with customers and provide both marketing and service interactions into personalized, contextual conversations at scale. On April 10th, Salesforce introduced its latest offering public sector Einstein One for service. This new solution offers AI-powered features to help government employees automate administrative tasks and improve constituent engagement. With notable features like caseworker narrative generation and integration with Salesforce's data cloud system, public sector Einstein One for Service uses generative AI to analyze vast amounts of data swiftly, generate case reports, record real-time call transcriptions, and provide a range of other capabilities, all from a single unified solution. Salesforce on April 18th rolled out Slack AI, the platform's native generative AI experience, to all paid customers. The popular workplace communication app also received major upgrades like expanded language support, including Japanese and Spanish, with additional language support coming soon. In other features, Slack AI includes the recap feature that delivers a daily morning digest of channel summaries for users to follow. A conversation summaries feature allows users to generate highlights from channels and threads, and a search answers feature that provides personalized and intelligent responses to conversational queries. The company said Slack AI will be available to businesses of all sizes and is priced at $10 per user per month for Slack Pro and Business Plus plans. On April 22nd, Salesforce rolled out its Sustainable AI Policy Principles, a new framework to guide AI regulations, reduce environmental impact, and spur climate innovation and sustainability. The enterprise software maker said that it aims to work with regulators and lawmakers to enhance environmental regulation of AI, including concerns around energy use and lack of emissions disclosure. In addition, Salesforce reported supporting five nonprofits in developing AI-focused solutions to address the urgent challenges of climate change. 
Salesforce unveiled a series of significant AI announcements at its NYC World Tour 2024 event. Einstein Copilot, the company's flagship conversational AI assistant, took center stage when Salesforce announced its general availability, including a suite of new tools and bundles designed to enhance seller productivity and accelerate generative AI adoption. Salesforce also announced the general availability of new sales actions for Einstein Copilot, including features like close plans, forecast guidance, call explorer, follow-up emails, and Einstein Copilot in Sales Cloud everywhere. The company also unveiled Copilot Analytics, a set of tools that enables admins to track and audit Copilot usage and uncover adoption trends to scale deployments. There was a lot of excitement surrounding the Sales Blazor and Service Blazor programs at the event. Salesforce's Sales Blazor community, a rapidly expanding network of sales professionals, now offers real-time collaboration via Slack. Additionally, the CRM giant launched a premier destination for service and field service professionals called serviceblazor.com. Both platforms allow members to stay informed about the latest trends, network based on roles, and grow in their careers. Slack was in the spotlight as it unveiled a new user experience for sales leaders called Slack Sales Elevate. The latest sales workplace unifies Salesforce insights and automates opportunity tasks with Slack AI capabilities that enable sales teams to access a consolidated view of the information they need to collaborate better and close deals faster. Another significant announcement was the introduction of two bundle solutions, the AI Implementation Bundle and the Data Governance Bundle. The AI Implementation Bundle is a comprehensive toolkit that combines essential development tools enabling it teams to build, test, and deploy AI experiences across their organization. On the other hand, the Data Governance Bundle brings together key security and privacy capabilities to protect and manage sensitive customer data. Salesforce also unveiled an expansion of its Zero Copy Partner Network. The network includes charter members like Amazon Web Services, Databricks, Microsoft Azure, Google Cloud, Snowflake, and it is committed to building secure, bi-directional zero-copy integrations with Salesforce Data Cloud. The company also unveiled innovations, including new zero-copy support for data warehouses and lakehouses, built on open table formats like Apache Iceberg, and new zero-copy data kits that enable ISV partners to bring valuable data sets to Data Cloud customers. Last but not least was the launch of AI-powered capabilities to help banks handle transaction disputes quickly and efficiently. The new Gen AI features include Transaction Dispute Management, Einstein Copilot Banking Actions, and Service Processes Library. These capabilities combine transaction data from customers' banking platforms with Salesforce insights to streamline manual tasks, minimize errors, address issues, and more, all from a single unified platform. That's all in this edition of the Salesforce Monthly Roundup. To get more updates and insights from the Salesforce world, subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching. We will be back soon with more updates.